dropping things. Ha! <laughs> I did not prepare for this, apparently. <laughs> It's Jay and today I'm here with my April favorites for 2018. I'm just gonna say now I don't actually have that many favorites because all I did for the month of April was study and cry because exams. So without further ado, let us get started. You know, the topic of crying and being done exams leads me to my first favorite and that is that I am done university year four I only have one more semester to go until I'm graduating and I'm just like I am so ready to be done the girl is over school I'm just saying okay moving on the next favorite that I have is actually in my phone case it is this little kitty cat and I think it is the cutest thing in the entire world I'm obsessed with it but I got it off of wish y'all know your girl is obsessed with wish but it was only five dollars and now my phone is a cat so I am beyond happy about this development. My next favorite is a lip product that I have been using like crazy because I lost my favorite lip stuff and I had to, you know, improvise with what I had in my bathroom and I found this. It's the Blistex Fruit Smoothies Melon Melody Lip Product Balm. I don't know, but it's SPF 15. Not that I care about that. It is so moisturizing like my lips will be so dry and I'll put this on once and like instantly my lips are silky smooth again and I absolutely love it. It came in a three pack. There's like also berry melody and then melon melody and then like a orange mango one or something like that. Then my next three favorites are actually TV shows and one movie. The movie that I absolutely loved <laughs> this month is called Blockers and it's the new movie that features John Cena and he is so good in it. He has such good comedic timing. I thought he was so good in it and I wish that he was in more movies because I would binge watch them all. It also has Leslie Mann in it who I absolutely love in everything so just the two of them together worked so well for me so I highly recommend it. If you haven't watched it already it is hilarious. It's one of those movies where like you don't need to think at all while watching it. It's just funny. The next TV show that I've been watching with my mom and I'm obsessed with it. It's called Siren and it's basically about these mermaids that come to land and they learn how to be human kind of and there's this whole government conspiracy thing going on. It's actually really good. Acting is terrible like it is not it's not good but the storyline is addictive and I want to know what happens next. Killer mermaids I like that shit so I'm into it. The next TV show that I binge watched and finished with my mom is Santa Clarita Diet and it is the season two. I was so upset once it was over. It's basically about a woman who dies and then becomes a zombie but she like looks like a human. She just eats human flesh but it has this one character named Eric who is the zombie's daughter's best friend and he is so funny. I have no idea who plays him. I'll put a picture of him right here, but he is absolutely hilarious. He makes the entire show for me. Highly recommend watching both seasons. The dad is also hilarious, but the woman is Drew Barrymore. And now it is time for my favorite part of the video where I get to lip sync poorly to my favorite songs of the month. My two favorite songs of the month are Sam Smith again because I've literally just been listening to his album, Thrill of It All, still obsessed with it. It's like on repeat in the car when I go anywhere. But the first song that I've been loving is One Last Song. I just think it's so catchy. I just love it so much. So here it is. <laughs> I 
just love Sam Smith's voice. I find it so soothing. Like, he could literally sing anything and I would just, like, love it completely. And then the second song off of his album that I've been listening to like crazy is called No Peace and it's featuring Yeba. But I just love their voices together. I think they sound so good. So here it is. I just think that both of their voices together is so beautiful and just uh, I love that entire album again if you have not listened to Thrill of it all please go buy the album because he's just a little baby angel unicorn and I love him so so much all right guys so those were my favorites for this month I know there's not a lot but as I said university kicked my ass this month so I didn't really do much but lie in my bed and feel sorry for myself so there'll probably be more next month but we'll see let me know down below a couple of your favorites of this month and I'll see you all in my next video goodbye